righteous court chambers, is it not a cause governess Wiggum the kingdom that rests upon the shoulders of the eternal only wise God Jesus the Christ righteous court chambers is it not a cause here in earth today penalty to be instituted to prevent others from overindulging in another's work made accessible to their measure of faith due to their measure of faith The kingdom of God is requiring us to go by things legally amongst each other. To be instituted to bring accountability to such one that build upon the spirit that is subject to the prophet or prophetess. A penalty for the church or ministries that do not pay custom or dues. A penalty for the country that do not pay dues. Penalty for the congregation that do not set up provision for his members. They will be, there will be a penalty for talebearers and for those who cohabitate with them, it's called treason. Now, we know that what things soever the law saith, it saith to them who are under the law, that every mouth be that every mouth may be stopped, and all the world may become guilty before <clears throat> excuse me, guilty before God. Therefore by deeds of the law there shall no flesh be justified in his sight, for by the law is the knowledge of sin. But now the righteousness of God is without the law, is manifested, being witnessed by the law and the prophets, identifying those by the law of works, identifying those by the law of faith. Even the righteousness of God, which is by faith of Jesus Christ unto all and upon all them that believe, for there is no difference. For all have sinned and and come short of the glory of God, being justified freely by his grace. The redemption that is in Christ Jesus. In the era of declaring God's Son righteousness, when Jesus, when God has set forth to be a propitiation through faith in his blood to declare his righteousness for the remission of sins that are part 
through the forbearance of God that are passed through the forbearance of God to declare I say at this time his righteousness that he might be just and the justifier of him which believeth in Jesus where is boasting then it is excluded by what law of works nay but by the law of faith therefore we conclude that a man is justified by faith without the deeds of the law Christ righteous court chambers righteous court chambers are to institute penalties for offenses and transgressions things that shall come forth we are working toward justice and peace thank you Lord Jesus for each and every word that proceeds out of my mouth that I read from Corinthians as well. In the Lord Jesus' name, hallelujah, amen.